Yo, what's happening? Today we're going to be looking at the 3DS store, the Japanese version. I have a Japanese 3DS, as you can see, and it's pretty updated. They're talking about stuff that's happening in 2022 on sale, so that's pretty interesting. You have Sega. Let's see what games they have for Sega. Okay. So we got Sonic Boom, obviously. Sonic Boom again. That this takes forever, my guy. Come on, it's on sale and you're not going to show me. So it's 800 Wow, this is actually really cheap. If you wanted to buy this, it's literally a dollar. Like, under a dollar. If I remember correctly, or have my uh, yen to US dollars... I think I might be wrong. I'm actually second guess, second guessing. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Sonic Boom is called Sonic Tune in Japan. Forgot about that. I did want to make a video about those little differences. So you got a bunch of games on sale. 50% uh, off. Very interesting. Once again, everything's still on sale. 400 yen. Um, actually, I got my phone. I probably should should look yen to dollars, pretty much. I'm, I'm guessing 400 yen is like three dollars. Fantasy Zone? Oh, actually, I played this game. It's pretty good. Alright, so 400 yen is like three bucks. I was correct. So, it's not that expensive. I don't know why I said it was under a dollar. I was getting confused. Uh, Sonic... Is under two bucks, so it's it's pretty interesting. It's definitely pretty interesting to see uh, games on sale. Uh, they also have a Square Enix sale. It looks like there's a lot of games on sale. You have Pokemon uh, Sun and Moon, but these games are not on sale. Nope, they're not on sale. They're it, they're 100 percent expensive. Five thousand. Seven, uh, 478 yen? That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. You might as well buy a physical copy at this point. Pokemon Crystal should be under 10 bucks. Uh, let's see what we got. Uh, it's 1,200? That's a bit odd. So 1,200 would be like $10. That's not too bad. Let me check real quick. Yeah, it's like 893. 893, not too bad. Pokemon. Pokemon will never be on sale. May I, 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 don't, I didn't play on 3DS my whole life, so I can't really, uh, I can't necessarily say that, uh, you know, Pokemon games have never been on sale, because I've never been on the store all the time. I just recently decided to play, uh, 3DS this year, in 2022. I actually have had this 3DS since 2020. I bought this before the whole uh, price spikes. I bought this 3DS for like legitimately like under 30 bucks. No joke. Everything's expensive now. I bought this. It's it's not in great condition. I'll show you the video one day. Okay, so this game, the Dragon Quest Trilogy, it's actually on Switch. So uh, that's pretty interesting. I didn't know it came out previously on the 3DS. You got Puyo Puyo, Mario Kart. Seven, uh, Metroid Re Samus Returns. You got a lot of games. Obviously, you got Doraemon. Is is it's pretty much like like advertising towards the Japanese audience, as you could see. Uh, let's see how much this game costs. Oh, this game costs like uh, seven bucks, six dollars. Mother two, uh, around ten bucks almost. Uh, Eight ninety something, almost ten dollars. It's pretty interesting, in case you all want to play your uh, your favorite classics. One thing that I hate about this is it takes forever to load. Uh, the 3DS apparently, at least this version, I can't talk about the new 3DS. Um, it runs on 3 gigahertz compared to the 5... I don't know, understand why, but that's just how it goes. Uh, Nintendo eShop Top... I'm confused. There's like two of them, and they both have 3DS on them, so I'm kind of confused. So this is the top game, this game right here. Hurry up and load on top so the people can see. Come on! What's the matter with you? Dude, I can't see anything. 
Okay, now you're loading. Dragon Quest 3 is very popular, apparently. I don't know what this game is about. Oh, yeah, what am I talking about? Dragon Quest is popular in Japan. Why should I be surprised that it's popular still? Is this... I can't... I can't read Japanese, so I can't necessarily understand what that means. It says ranking, top 100, and it has a, a 3DS with a... Uh, with a how you call it the console and this one has the cartridge with the i'm assuming the console one is probably like the digital games and these are the physical games that have a digital version i don't really know dude i hate how long this loads radiant historia these are all atlas games uh no bandai it looks like these are like rpg it's pretty interesting i'm actually very surprised. There is some games I plan to play on the virtual console. Obviously, that we know what that one is. Virtual console. Oh wow! Surprised they they have a Switch ad. Are they trying to encourage people to get a Switch? Uh, honestly, I'd rather stick with the 3DS. I I'm, I'm, I would guess that the 3DS has more of a better battery life. That's just my personal opinion. All right. Well. Uh, I didn't show you very much because I don't know too much about this store. I hope I went through most of the stuff. I went through some sales. I went through some games. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be playing. I'm not, I'm not going to. I'm going to be playing this game for sure though. But not the Japanese version. No siree. I actually own. Uh, I think I own. Three 3DS's in English. In US, USA region. I only bought this Japanese one because, well, it was cheap, and it's actually great to, when, it, when you buy a 3DS for cheap. Alright, I'm out. Peace.